it is currently 9 54 p.m and guess what i'm gonna go to the gym what's up you guys welcome back to my youtube channel and today i am going to be doing seven days of lauren geraldo's 12 3 30 challenge so before i get into this challenge i just want to go ahead and give you guys a little background on this entire challenge uh lauren geraldo's challenge golly so how many times you finna say challenge uh called the 12 3 30 challenge uh, I went viral on TikTok. Um, she had some amazing results. Basically, the whole challenge revolves around you being on a treadmill, setting it at uh, an incline of 12 with a speed of 3 for 30 minutes. Sounds easy, but y'all, I tell you, it's pretty brutal. It is pretty brutal. Um, and I'm just going to take you guys each day by day what I did and how I felt after each day. Um, going into this challenge, I didn't expect a lot, like a really big drastic change because I'm only doing for, doing it for seven days. Um, I did expect myself to lose, you know, a little bit of my flatten out the stomach, even though, you know, I, I just really kind of wanted to lose some inches, which I did. Um, but this challenge was not easy, but it wasn't hard. It for those who, it's, it's very beginner friendly. I'll say it like that. Um, if you're someone who is just trying to get in shape or you're trying to lose weight, it is a great challenge. Honestly, I will say go out, get a gym membership and do it. Make sure you guys like, comment, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel and to this video. What if y'all like content like this? Because I kind of like making content like this. So fun fact, um, this is actually tuesday today's tuesday this is day two of the challenge i didn't actually record yesterday so that's that's why i'm starting it on today um because i really didn't plan to actually make a youtube video out of this but i was like maybe you guys want to be interested in like watching this or whatever so i decided to make a video about it it is currently 9 54 p.m and guess what i'm gonna go to the gym and do this 12 3 30 challenge Cause, woo! Your girl gotta lose some weight. Woo! All right, so this day wasn't actually too bad. Um, while I was on the treadmill, I did sweat a lot, especially right here. Um, I, it also helps because I I did have on a sweatshirt, but I mean. Honestly, it wasn't too bad. My legs did hurt a little bit, but once you start it, you kind of get used to it and it starts to go by a little bit faster. So, yeah. All right, you guys. So, I am done with day two. Um, my legs feel a little numb, um, but that's just because I did a little bit of booty workout. So, you know, honestly, today it went by a little bit faster than it did it yesterday. Um, so, yeah. I'll see you guys tomorrow. All right, so I'm actually on my way to the gym now. It's like 9.40. I'm in the bathroom. And um, it's supposed to be some bad weather. And um, I'm going to try to get up there really quickly and get home very quickly. So I might not do an entire hour workout, but I'm definitely going to do the 12 3 30. So stay. Day three. You guys, by this day, I was completely over. I was so sleepy and so tired, but I got myself up out of that bed and I went to the gym. I walked in so slowly, as y'all see right here. Like, I literally took my time getting to that treadmill because I was like, oh my gosh, I cannot wait to get this over with. But honestly, by the time I started, I realized that, you know, once I get it done, I feel so much better about myself, and I definitely did. Like, this day was honestly probably one of my easier days, and I was just so happy that I went. And by the time I left, it was just a weight off my shoulders because I accomplished something today. So I just got home from the gym, and today was actually a little bit easier today. I only did the 12 3 30, and then I just went into some leg press, uh, and then I did the hip abductors. Uh, so all of that took like an hour. I got there like 10, 10, 10, and I left around like 11, 20, something like that. And yeah, so today was a little bit easier. 
had a good little workout. Um, I can say it went by a little bit faster probably because I was looking at the TV today. So I was able to get through my workout. Um, kind of felt like 15 minutes, but you know, I looked up. Next thing I looked, you know, once I looked down, it was like, I was 15 minutes in. I was like, oh, you gotta get into it. Period. So yes, see y'all on day you guys so it's currently 7 40 p.m on thursday this is day four of doing the 12 3 30 challenge and so far ah, i just be feeling like this challenge has been okay it haven't been too bad so far like it's been getting easier day by day but i have decided to go earlier because y'all know i'll be going to like 10 o'clock at night but I've decided to go a little bit earlier today because of inclement weather. So day four, I was extremely sluggish this day. That's why I, I was sweating so much this day, y'all. Like, I wasn't even, like, 10 minutes in. I was sweating that bad. <laughs> I was glistening. But that was only because I had eaten something earlier that day. Unfortunately, my crazy self decided to eat McDonald's, which knowing I was going to be sluggish. But, yeah, day four. Today was a little bit harder, I guess, because my dumb self decided to eat before I came. So just a little disclaimer, don't eat before coming here because y'all, I struggled to get through the day. Like I was sweating more as y'all see in the previous clip, but it's fine. Like I got through it. It wasn't too bad. I did a little bit of booty and so I just left. So, so yeah, you guys, I'll see you guys on day five. Sadly, this is actually the only clip that I got from this day, so sorry you guys. I didn't do too much recording on day five, but this is it. All right, so we are on our way to the gym right now. It's day six, and yeah, I'm going early, which is something new for me because y'all know I like to go at night when there's no people, but I'm gonna go early because I have something to do later on today. Um, on to do this challenge, you know, day six when I made it to Spark, had to keep going and tomorrow's the last day! I'm so excited, you know, you feel me, but, um, let's get to the gym. Day six, I had so much more motivation than I did earlier in the week. Um, day six actually went by a little bit faster than, and I, I know I keep saying that, but day six really did go by super duper 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 fast. Um, and I was just like getting it done. I was just in that gym. I think I went late or I, oh no, I went early this day. So it went by super duper fast. I was able to go and enjoy myself after I finished the gym and you guys like, I felt really good like I was getting through the workouts I was I even started doing like other stuff that day and it was just really motivating and I was so happy that I went to the gym that day all right you guys so I just got back in the car um I didn't film while I was in there because I was kind of like there's kind of a lot of people in there so I didn't feel comfortable so yeah I did the 12 3 30 plus I did like a little extra five minutes I'm trying to say this fast because my phone's about to die but yeah uh day seven last day wasn't that bad I actually went by pretty fast so that is one thing about it and so far you know this challenge wasn't too bad and yeah great workout glad that that's over so now you know i can relax thank you jesus And this is my after, y'all. I am so sorry. I didn't do it before, but I know I can definitely see a visible difference in my stomach, especially like prior to my weight loss journey. And y'all, my waist is a little bit snatched than it used to be. And I added this little clip from day three. And y'all, this challenge is a 10 out of 10 recommend. Definitely do it. Right, so seven days are up. You know, overall, this entire challenge wasn't hard like i said but it wasn't easy i could say take it day by day um ladies if you need some motivation i got y'all you know and if y'all like seeing content like this i will continue to make content like this because like i said i actually like doing this i like working out you know but um I, it, the, I think the hardest part for me is just really getting up and going to the gym. And I know I'm not the only one that feels that way. 
I definitely think that it's all about discipline and motivating yourself and eating right. It's very important, y'all. But please, please, please try it out. Tell me how you feel about it. You know, I know my results aren't drastic. I wasn't expecting them to be drastic. But I did want to show you guys that you can lose weight. You know, this challenge does work. You just have to be consistent, you know, eating right. Like I said, consistency and eating right and drinking a lot of water, staying hydrated is very important. One tip I would give you guys is just like I, like I saw in the other clip, don't eat before you go to the gym. I messed up with that. That was my mess up. You know, like I said, the first day wasn't hard, but it wasn't easy. You feel me? But I got through it. I got through the whole seven days. That's all that matter. That's all that matter. That's all that matter. Okay. But thank you guys for watching this video. If you like this video, make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel and to this video. Thank you guys so much. Thank you guys. Love you guys. Ooh, I know I miss what you want me to do. I'm about to make the news. I got a side hand.